everybody bag is different. And you may sit up here and have a good dude that that can be something. And I'm not saying, hold on, let me finish. I'm listening. I'm not. Not necessarily, respond. you know, can be something, but a more or less like they just need polishing. They're dull. Their knife is dull. Let me sharpen that shit up and say, hey, bro, that's unacceptable. Just like I talk to the girl and say, bro, you're not enough. Okay, cool. Listen, let me prove to you that what you're doing is hurting me. Some people may care. Like, may not. It's a lot of polygamous relationships out here that's thriving. That's booming. But there's honesty. Cheating and being a polygamous or polyamory re relationship, there's transparency. That's the difference that we're talking about. So you would tell, how many daughters do you have? Two. Okay, so you would tell them to just polish him off a little bit. He's just a little bit of a cheater. Stay with him. But That's what, would, would you tell your daughters that? If, I want you to look at one of these cameras and say you would tell your daughters to accept that shit. I'm not saying it. No, but that's what you're saying. Can he say it? Because I'm not telling my son that you can cheat on a woman and that a woman that you claim you love and that's okay just because you're a high value man. You have a lot of money. Like a lot of women will want to be with you. That's not okay. Because you're only cheating yourself out of something real. Let's be fucking clear. Man or woman. So let's look at one of these cameras and you tell them, what are your daughter's names? Shakira. And Sovereign, right? Sovereign Dior. Okay. Then tell them. Tell them that it's okay to get cheated on as long as the guy has 80% of what you want. So Brittany Renner and Cam Newton, they had another sit down. And one of the topics they were discussing was, because Cam Newton was saying, if a man got a certain stature or he got money, as a woman, she should understand that he's cheating or he's doing wrong. And she should polish him and help him like, I guess, stop cheating or steer him in the right direction. And Brittany Renner kind of called him out with like, hold on, how many daughters you got? You got two daughters, right? Would you, as, as their father, tell them to accept the man wrongdoing, accept cheating, and just be like, look, let me let me fix you. Let me get you to stop cheating. And he, he couldn't answer that with a straight face. He, could, he couldn't tell her, yes, I would tell my daughters to do that because he know that's wrong. Like, in a relationship, it got to be 50-50. It got to be a give and take. Yes, somebody can cheat and the, and the other person can take them back. But it's up to them to take them back. Cam Newton basically saying, look, I got money, I got fame. You're supposed to take me back. No, nobody's obligated to take you back. If you cheat, that person can leave right then and there. Or that person can stay and y'all can get through it. You know what I'm saying? But you can't just straight up assume the woman is going to stay there to polish you, to bring you up. Because would you do the same for her? That's a question you got to ask yourself, man. What y'all think about this? This is your bud. Be make sure to like, comment, subscribe. I'm out.